hello everyone uh, welcome to my channel how to do this today i'm going to talk about uh, gram.js library this library is very powerful library if you run your program on your uh, telegram then you can use this library so the use case is if you want to run your uh, channel on telegram by using this library you can do that easily like uh, uh posting some codes every day on your channel or something that you want to automate that you can do it easily with this library also the other use case you can create your bots and run uh run those bots uh by using this particular library so this is very powerful library we will go and talk about uh, how we can uh make use of these this library so i will start with the authentication first and then we will dig deeper uh into this library so let's get started so now what i'm going to do i'm going to create a project uh the name uh, i'm going to put here is uh, mkdir or uh, telegram oops so you can give your name whatever you want to all right now i will go into that directory uh so that will be in practice telegram codes. okay this is the folder now i am in uh, telegram codes uh this will be our main file main dot js all right here i will write the code whatever is written in this guide you can refer this guide uh, i will uh provide the link in the description uh this is gram.js.org so you will be able to uh, access this guide as easily I'll go from the start. What we'll do is uh, we'll go through this entire uh, page. Uh, so in the table of content, you will see the advanced documentation, installation, and full API. The advanced documentation. Uh, if you want to uh, advanced documentation, this is very 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 helpful uh, if you use it. Uh, so I'm not going to follow this one. I will follow this one. So you can check out this better document also. So for installation, what I will do, I will run this command and pm i telegram. So this will install the, the telegram library. So here I entered the command and I ran it. This will install all the dependencies. So first I have to do uh, npm init. So okay, npm in it. So we'll enter whatever is default. I will take that only. So now it has created this uh, package.json. I will again reinstall uh, this uh, npm telegram library. So, so here you can see that it's installed telegram 2.17.10. And now come back to uh, main.js. We'll write the code here. Uh, so here. We copy this entire code uh, and paste it here. So one more one more thing that I want to talk about is uh, this one. Uh -huh, yeah, this one. So go to this link and here you 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 will have to generate your own uh, uh, API ID and API hash. So once you generate that, put uh, the API ID and API hash here. And this is. Uh, string session so this string session once once we generate the token by using this program you can copy that uh, session token here and paste it here so this will not generate uh, so again in future if you run this program it will not generate a different token you will be able to use directly this in the existing token so let me uh, let me put the api api id and api hash here So as you can see that we have added uh, uh, API ID and API uh, hash key here. And now what I will do is um, it will ask us a phone number and the password. Uh, this program will ask. And uh, once this, this is done, it will ask for phone code that we will provide. So just going to provide my number here. Okay, yeah, the, this is my phone uh, phone number, and I will just enter my password here. Uh, 
but this is a secret password so uh, i'm just going to pause this video and we'll add this in the credential files and we'll retrieve from this file to uh, this file so i have just added the password i'm just going to run this program now All right, so something is happening. All right, so API hash is already being declared. I will just want to remove this. I will use this, uh, which is already here. I will remove this area. Uh, now I'm going to do this again. It should run successfully. So it is saying export unexpected token export, right? Hello. Uh, so there were there were some issues with the with the installation. So what I did is I just added this type module, and uh, I also didn't didn't install this input. Uh, so I I had to install this, uh, and also like I uh, changed this import stick from constant to import statement because of some I was getting some issues. So I did some changes on this. Also this this was Telegram session. Uh, earlier, so now I have added uh, Telegram. Uh, oh, sorry, in index.js also. So these are the changes that I have uh, made here. All right. Now I'm going to start this. So now it is started. Uh, I received uh, a code in Telegram. Once if if you follow my video then you will also receive a code in your uh, telegram i'll just go and enter that that code here so i have added it uh, i have just uh, entered that code which i received on my telegram uh, number um, and just now i got this uh, token JWT token. so what i will do i will just paste go and paste it here Now I pasted it here, so whenever I will uh, run this program again, I, I don't need uh, need to put uh, need not, not need to authenticate again and again. Uh, it will it will it will uh, pick that uh, token from here, and uh, you can do whatever we want. So this is this this is the entire video on authentication. Uh, uh, hope you like this video. Please subscribe to the channel, like this video. Uh, this will uh, increase uh, us to make more videos on our youtube channel or this if this is helpful uh please let us know in comments any question any concern let us know in comments uh, thank you for watching our videos bye bye